Hello boys and girls! In the first part of this series I talk about the preparations needed to get us to Patras on Peloponnese. So far we have been lucky both times I went paddling in Greece and the water levels were just sufficient for the rivers on Peloponnese. We will have a look at four of them over the next few videos. The first two are a combination as the river you put in confluence into the other one. These are the Luisios and the Alvios. To get there drive parallel to the west coast south from Patras to Pyrgos where you turn east up the Alvius river passing Olympia. While I never visited there I have it on good authority that you can get towels there. Head for Teisoa where you leave the good road behind and drive through the village down towards the river. Holding right will bring you to the put out. The way to the put in goes back up to the road above the village and further up river to the village of Caritena. Drive through the village and you reach the put in at the first road bridge. Apparently there is also an upper more difficult section on the Loisios. But who wants to start the season with that, right? From here the Luisios flows through small gorges in a tropical environment that is so unlike the dry hilltops through which you drove uh, to get to this jewel. The confluence is some three kilometers downriver. No idea what that is in miles so we'll have to stick with the uh, metric system for this series. The confluence with the bigger Alpheus happens in a shallow and wide section. In fact, the first time I mistook it for a large eddy. The first time the water levels were better. I noted 10 cubic meters uh, per second at the put in on the Luisias, which with hindsight it probably wasn't. The second time I estimated the flow at 4 cubic meters per second. The differences can be seen at the first drop on the uh, Alpheus that you want to have a look at, uh, at least from the boat before pushing through. Uh, the below can have stones or wood in there that require careful navigation. Shortly after that drop a stone eagle head on the left border before a left turn marks the entry to the grandiose Alpheus Gorge which is crossed high above by a stone road bridge. Within that gorge all kinds of adventures can be had. For example swimming snakes that remind you that you're no longer in Central Europe. Once the canyon opens up a bit, the most difficult section is located. It can be inspected and portaged on the left side. What did I say in the beginning? Don't take any risks on the first day on the water, especially if you're rusty. Fortunately, no boats were harmed in this production. The first time with more water there were other options that one could take. Even more water would open up additional possibilities. From here on out the difficulties become a bit easier, but at times the way between the huge boulders is not always clear. The put out is shortly after the gorge opens up. <laughs> 